Greetings, Internet, and welcome to another episode of A Comedy Musician Reacts. My name is Insane Ian, I am a comedy musician and a comedy music fan, and this week I am reacting to the brand new epic rap battles of history, Luke Skywalker vs. Harry Potter. Or, Harry Potter vs. Luke Skywalker. And it's the same thing, but it's written as Harry Potter first. But, uh, yeah, I'm looking forward to this one. Uh, just judging from the thumbnail, I haven't seen it yet, but on the thumbnail, it shows Lego versions of them, which makes the second time that ERB has done a Lego rap battle. The first time was Zeus versus Thor, uh, and that one was pretty great. Uh, so uh, I'm assuming that both of these are going to be voiced by Lloyd and Peter and just animated with Legos. Um, but before we get into that, if you all could do the uh, normal things of like, share, comment, subscribe, and if you really want to help me out, check out my Patreon at patreon.com slash insaneian, where I, that helps me make more videos like these, as well as music videos and my own music. Uh, but of course, also the link to this video, without me talking over it, will be in the description below. And all that stuff out of the way now, yeah, let's get into the new ERB. Probably not as divisive as the last one I reacted to. I hope. Anyway. And the Lego is Lego. That doesn't sound like Lloyd or Peter. That's interesting. I wonder who that actually is. Turn it up slightly so I can hear it a little better. A little soul patch. <laughs> I'm not gonna break down every single bar because it's a first impression and I'm not GeniusLyrics.com. Uh, so I'm not going to break apart everything that they say, but uh, Accio Mike, I'm a Harry Potter nerd a little bit. I I'm, I'm, I'm a Hufflepuff. I have a song about that. Uh, but yeah, I, if you want something to come to you, you say Accio. So yeah, that's a thing. Hermione and Ron about to get it on. They're a couple. It's funny for the fandom. It, it's not great bars, but all right. My mouth spits up like incendio flames. You lukewarm like some tauntaun remains. Even <laughs> okay, lukewarm like some tauntaun remains is pretty great. Uh, I don't know who this is. This is this is driving me nuts. I'm the mad eye of my man, Alistair Moody could see your franchise only has two decent movies. Such a feeling. <laughs> you sense deja vu. You're getting smoked like your uncle Owen and Aunt Maru. Your acting is flat and your raps are too deep too. Fuck her off to the afterlife where you're fat and see through. You're the <laughs> where you're fat and see-through. Ooh, that's... Oh, that's that's kind of more against Mark Hamill than it is Luke Skywalker. I don't think he's fat. I mean... I'm kind of fat, but I don't think Mark Hamill's fat. He's older. He's an older guy. Just how it is. Um, I'm a big, I'm a big fan of both Harry Potter and Star Wars. So, I mean, I've done songs about both. I've done whole EPs about both. Dear God. Am I your prototypical nerdcore musician or what? Huh. Anyway. You sense deja vu? You get smoked like your uncle Owen and on the roof. Your acting is flat and your raps are too deep too. I like in the background, uh, Hagrid has an egg and it turns into a dragon. That's very nice. The animation on this is top quality. The uncle Owen and on the roof being the, uh, the skeleton. It's so good. Uh, yeah, I pause a lot. Sorry. It's gonna happen. It's a reaction thing. It's what I do. And also, coming at it from a comedy musician perspective, I'm pointing out the things that work in a video. If you're new to the channel. Anyway. Dies only has two decent movies. Such your feelings. You sense deja vu? You're getting smoked like your uncle Owen and Aunt Maru. Your acting is flat and your raps are too deep too. Fuck them off to the afterlife where you're fat and see through. You're the biggest letdown in your series since Snoke. And you sent your father's Vader. All you do is choke. Uh. You, and you are 2D2. I just caught being the R2D2 line. 
The bit about Snoke is brilliant. That's a... It's the... Man, I really wish Last Jedi actually had a sequel. I like Last Jedi. I don't care about saying that on the internet. It was good. Um, and uh, it's, it makes sense that you're Vader's son and all you do is choke. That's a quality burn. That is a quality burn. There are some better bars as the verse has gone on. Country bumpkin, you must be dumb. Who farms moisture on a desert planet with two suns? <laughs> stop my plans in your dusty bin droid. I'll leave you like a horcrux, split up and destroyed. I don't know who made you shoot first, but that missed. If I was you, I'd have a bad feeling about this. Okay, that's clearly nice, Peter. That's clearly nice, Peter playing Luke. Doing the whiny Luke voice, too. Yeah, right. I buy that. My plans in your dusty bin droid. I'll leave you like a horcrux, split up and destroyed. I don't know who made you shoot first, but that missed. If I was you, I'd have a bad feeling about this. Oh, I'm a rhyming Jedi like my father before me. You're talking hats, should have put you in Griffin Dorky. Your only <laughs> story is mostly stolen from me. You might be Potter, but Harry, I planted your seed. Let's see. Little orphan raised by relatives in solitude. Suddenly gets taken under wing of Bucky Wizard Dude. Ha <laughs> ha! Oh, we're going through the hero's journey that both movies do. Awesome. Learns that he's Bedessa do have powerful gifts, but between the two of us, I think I got the cooler stick. Swing it. <laughs> My saber cuts through you so slicey. Leave you on the floor like an arm at most icely. Hit you with the wampa wraps. I get icy. Land him in your face like that'll do nicely. I think that was Mark Hamill doing a Han Solo impression. I'd be very surprised if that wasn't Mark Hamill doing a Hans, doing a, a Harrison Ford Han Solo impression. Just saying that'll do nicely. Holy crap. He's done that before, by the way. He's done that on the, uh, the uh, bad lip reading videos uh, where they did bad lip reading of, of Star Wars. I think they did Force Awakens and Mark Hamill was there, but he didn't, he because Luke wasn't in that movie very much, he voiced all of the Han Solo stuff because he does an amazing Harrison Ford impression and that's what that sounded like to me you know who else does a good Harrison Ford impression Dan from Game Grumps and Ninja Sex Party I might be a little obsessed with that show or something whatever anyway the 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 tempo on this one's a little weird the the flow is kind of slower than what I'm used to on ERB so it's still good. I'm still enjoying it. Saber cuts through you so slicey. Leave you on the floor like an arm at most icely. It's a great line. The raps, I get icy. Land him in your face like that'll do nicely. I fly the X Wing to save a planet from massacre. You fly a broom with some kind of magical janitor. Your double dweeb <laughs> army likes to think that you're the best. All you did was use your mom like a bulletproof vest. The death Damn. of my mother saved the wizarding race. Your mom died of heartache when she saw your face. You swamp school <laughs> dropout. You're too whiny to rhyme. At least when I slither in the sister she isn't mine all right we finally got to an incest line and that was a deep burn that was excellent well done uh points to potter 10 points to gryffindor i'm sorry i have to say it at some point in this one that was great uh that's so good if my mother saved the wizarding race your mom died of heartache when she saw your face you swamp school drop out it's too whiny to rhyme at least when i slither in the system she isn't mine oh, i'm the boy you live best seller without equal i'll split you like your fan base is feeling about the prequels the sequels brought you back to meet your demise i'd say you were brilliant but i must not tell lies I nice jk straight rolling in cash you let jj compact your character to try both of those are true, uh, I, you know, but screw turfs. Um, yeah, that's some great bars in here. Again, I think Potter's bars, so far as this is going, are beating out Luke's a little bit. Luke has some great lines, don't get me wrong, but I think Harry's getting the sharper digs here. Sequels for you back to meet your demise. I'd say you were brilliant, but I must not tell lies. I left JK straight rolling in cash. You let JJ compact your character to trash. So go on, try and force more of your disses. You're like a stormtrooper. Cause all your shit misses. <laughs> that was dope. That's a great line. 
That's right, R2. It does sound like he left all this fire in the goblet. <laughs> Maybe he will get rescued by an anorexic hobbit. I think it's pretty clear that you and I are pretty different. Mine drives hyper, your drives privet. I've got more <laughs> rhymes than sand grains on Tatooine. You couldn't pull in the wind with a tractor beam. I crushed an empire, a galaxy large. I blew up the Death Star, you blew up Ant Mars. I popped you with Poppy Pop, it can't be healing you. And like a great disturbance in the force, I'm not feeling you. Death would eat you up without Hermione and what? Because your own skills, Wingardium Levio. Wingardium Levio suck. The the amount of spell puns and just spells in this are way more than I had actually anticipated, and I should have anticipated this many. There's not as many forced jokes, but forcing those rhymes was a great line too. There's a lot of great lines in this. Man, uh, this this is going about as good as I could have hoped for it. I'll pop you where Poppy Pomfrey is a reference I'm not familiar with because I've only seen the movies and not read the books. I'm I'm lame, I know. Where Poppy Pomfrey can't be healing you and like a great disturbance in the force I'm not feeling you. Death would eat you up without Hermione and what? Because your own skills Wingardium Levio suck. You're a dunk like dirt free but worse and I'd rather hurt nerf than have to endure your third birth. Have you heard rap right before? <laughs> that was not dope at all. Maybe have Goldie Ball show you the protocol. But On that verse, he kind of sounded like Stupendium. On that verse, he kind of sounded like Stupendium, but just, just there. If I found out at the end of this that it's actually Stupendium, I have to turn in my, my fan card. It's just, it's sad. Uh, yeah, but j just on that, those four bars there, it sounded like Stupendium. That was really good. And also calling C-3PO Goldie Balls. That's great. Like dirt free, but worse, and I'd rather hurt nerf than have nerf to endure your third birth. Have you heard rap before? That was not dope at all. Maybe have Goldie Ball show you the protocol. But I bet you're just distracted. You got a lot on your plate. On one hand, the rebellion. On the other hand, a oh, wait. Nice. I've got the Weasley's got my back. This muggle sucks more hole than the bloody Sarlacc. We'll rock you up good if you try to step to Harry, mate. You're the least intimidating twin since Mary Kay. I flow like <laughs> Buster Beer on Diagon Streets. You can find me getting fantastic. Fantastic on these beats. It's over, Luke. I got the high ground advantage. I'll close it like a map. Mischief managed. You should have had nice. Like a home that was all good. If I wanted teenage wizardry, I'd call Selena Gomez. My attack tactics are galactically hardcore. Far more than your goofy little Star Wars. I learned more from the best in the biz. Get funky. So up to the end, this is my clunky. My Jedi mind. Oh, that's, that's, good. that's a new Star Wars original trilogy thing, McClunky. It's what Greedo says before he shoots first in the new version. But he says McClunky. They didn't see that until it got added to Disney+. Plus. That was, was a thing. It was a whole thing a couple months ago when that happened. Actually, it may have been a year ago at this point. Ah, it's great. Also, there's a rap group called Jedi Mind Tricks. And that's prevalent and prescient for this. Prescient. Not prescient, prescient. I like SAT words. It's fine. It's a galactically hardcore, far more than your goofy little Scar Wars. I learned Scar more from the best in the biz. Get funky. So all of you that get this is McClunky. My Jedi mind <laughs> tricks, put the next on your imperium. Shift it up like that sticks on Bellatrix, dead serious. No need nice. to act really ominous, you're heartless in a duel. Call me the Hogwarts Express, I just took you to school. Hogwarts. Nice. Wow. Build it. <laughs> Made the Lego move their Lego game building noise. Great animation in this. Dave Brown, aka Boy in a Band, was Harry Potter. Dave Brown? Is that Let me check something here. Uh, let's see. Okay, no, that's not who I thought it was. He's an English YouTuber, musician, rapper, songwriter, comedian, and actor. 
Uh, the name Dave Brown made me think it was the Dave who does songs with Brennel Floss, but I was wrong. But uh, he was great. Uh, and, you know, I was right. Nice Peter was Luke. Um, were the other... Uh, and then it goes on to it, their Patreon things. That was great. That's kind of hard to pick a winner, but I think overall, I think Harry Potter had the better burns, had the better bars. Uh, Luke had some great lines, don't get me wrong, but I think overall, I think, uh, I think Harry came out on top on that one. Um, but what do you guys think? Let me know in the comments below how wrong you think I am and how much you want to comment about the weird things that I said. I'm sure you do. I'm sure you've already said it. That's the way YouTube comments work. But anyway, if you like this, please like, share, comment, subscribe. Maybe check out my Patreon to help me make more videos and music videos of my own, plus my own music. Check it all out in the links below. Plus, you can see this without me yammering all over it in the link in the uh, description below as well. And uh, we'll see you next time. Thanks very much. Goodbye. Use the force to turn off the camera. I rock rough and stuff with my huffle puffs. Hey! Rock on with your fair set. I rock rough and stuff with my huffle puffs. Hey! Rock on with your loyal set. I rock on with myself cause I'm huffle puff. It's the Hogwarts house still kicking up dust. So um, let me loosen up my house robes. And um, let me...